So let's create a bottom navigation in our MIT Apple Inventor app. So let's start this project. Okay, bottom navigation. So what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna add here the navigation in the bottom of my app. So I'm gonna use here two layouts. First layout is like vertical arrangement. And another one is called horizontal arrangement. I'm gonna make that vertical is with this fill parent like this. Okay, and hide. And make this horizontal should be like with this fill parent. Cool. So in this bottom horizontal arrangement, I'm gonna add here some icons. Okay. Icons means I'm gonna add some here menus. Okay. So how can I add it? So it's very simple. There's two ways to do this. So first one is you can simply add the images here and then use the conditions okay and the second option is that you can use the extension okay so here the extension name is bottom navigation bar extension okay so we can see this is the icon we can use as you can see all these icons we can use okay like this so i'm going to use these icons so for that i need to use here uh, this extension i'll give you the, that extension link in the description so just download this aix files go to the mit app inventor in the left side, you'll see the extension. Click on import extension, click on choose file. Now, just import that extension. Now, just drag and drop this extension. Cool. Now, go to the block section. And whenever the screen will in a slice, okay. Now, click on this bottom navigation. You can see the initialize this, okay. We need to initialize this in which arrangement? In the horizontal arrangement. Just drag and drop this. Cool. Now, we need to set some icons. How we can do this? So click on this bottom navigation and then you can see the set item. Just drag and drop this. Now this is the index. It means this is the positions where we have to set our icons. So first I'm going to make it like first like this index one. This is the first menu. Okay. Or the first navigation. This is the first menu. Icon path. We need to add the icon. As you can see, here, these are the icon, right? We need to add. So how can I add? this so it's simply just use the text like this and we need to add some images so go to the design and you can see the upload file and choose file you can download all these images as you can see i downloaded here some images so i'm going to just upload these you can download these images from icon library flighticon.com you can see there are a lot of icons you can simply search here like home and just download all these icons all these icons totally free of cost. Now, let's go to the MIT Apple Inventor and let me just upload all these icons. So, I have some three or four icons. Okay. Users, home, then I have one setting icon, this one, and I have one more icon, and that is chat icon. Now, go to the block section, and here we just to simply for the first, I'm going to just add here the chat.png. Okay. This one icon I'm going to add in the first. You can see this chat.png second okay now simply just copy paste like this change the index value to two and the navigation you can just make it like home home.png okay and oh make sure this is the label label means you need to write something right see the chat i'm gonna just write here and in the second i'm gonna just write here the third and fourth i needed here like this for a third one, I'm going to just write it here. You can see in the left side, you'll see the users. So user.png, user. And the fourth one is, you can, here, you can see here, settings.png, and settings. Cool. We had done. Now, let me, so let me go to the design. Here, you will see all the icons. Now, now let me show you how this will look okay you can see this is our uh, the icons like setting icon user home and the chat icon i can't find much uh, home icon you can change that home icon i think maybe the, okay this is the house okay so it's house not home so h-o-u-s-c.png okay and once you refresh it you will see the house also Fantastic. So we have these icons, right? Now, let me show you that how we can use them. 
this is the most important right how we can use them right when i click on the setting so their setting screen will should open right and the user or home or other screen should open right how how we can do this so it's very simple so i'm going to use here some suppose right to uh, horizontal vertical arrangement like right? under this vertical arrangement too okay and i'm gonna make this fill parent like this okay and i'm gonna just rename that vertical arrangement to vr it's a vertical arrangement and this is for this is for house okay vr house just simply okay the same just copy and paste okay another one and that one is called user vr user okay and again just copy paste and this third one is settings okay settings vr settings okay and need one more and that is called this vr chat vr means word arrangement okay vr chat so we have four layouts and i need to hide all these layouts like this cool now there's only one layout and that is the vr chat so make sure chat is is or this one right which one is our first one so click on the bottom navigation and you can see the set selected item okay this is the default so when screen will slide so we need to set this and this is the first one i need to select okay and you can see this is a chat here you see you can just add here the label or something here to just show the user like okay like this and make all this thing in a center so be big like this cool now i need to just hide this and i need to use here the vr chat oh, VR. oh sorry this is the user okay so i need to change this the user is okay and in the vr chat i need to show this okay this is the chat and here this is the user screen cool so i need to just visual off i need to just visual on the user chat and just put here and just say here now i can assign all the screens here okay like this so i can add any any component here okay in this uh, in this layout right so suppose i'm going to just add here another layer another thing is like settings all settings like this here center center like, like this okay phone pole and make it center like this cool now the default is a limit is this well off make sure vr chat should be visible like this okay now what you need to do here go to the block now whenever someone select okay you can see bottom navigation you can see the item selected right so whenever we click on the item okay so whenever we select any item so here we have the index value right so how we need to just assign this thing right so how we can do this so it's very simple is like we know that if condition right control if if someone selected the chat suppose okay it means they selected the index one okay and the value is we know that chat value is one chat is screen value right then we need to hide the house one right see visible visible off set visible we are house should be false and same for other three screens also like this you can see we are house setting and the user okay but else if okay else if someone select the another screen and that is called second one and the second screen is this which one we have second screen called the house okay home all these right so just copy this your house should be true but other okay other should be false okay like this so we are house is true but chat is false setting and user also false so select the false from here like this right and same thing we have to apply here also like we need to just add one more here is like chat okay this is chat and that should be true like this okay same thing we have to apply for other also 
okay so like as if one more as if and one more as if simple same settings okay for both like this one else if here and one more else if now we need to change the index value 3 and here is 4 3 is our 3 index value is our user right so it means user should be should be true all others should be false okay house false 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 and house is false yes then setting is our fourth screen is the settings so it means setting should be true and all other like wechat v user and the v house right should be false like this cool fantastic so we created the bottom navigation with all four screens right so let me show you how okay so let me show you how this will look okay in my phone so let me just connect this a companion you can see this is the chat screen is a default screen that we have selected now click on the home you can see this is the home screen click on user this is the user screen click on setting this is the setting screen so we have all four layouts here now we can do whatever we want to display in all these four screens and we have an amazing navigation bottom navigation menu in our MIT app inventor app fantastic cool so if you have any doubt you can ask me in comment thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day be safe and please don't forget to subscribe our channel like this video and share this video bye bye